Anyway, she got someone that she sees late night. I know. I woke up first thing I used to do was Hey guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Yaley. I've, I'm gonna have to like say that in all my videos now because clearly my name is a problem. People never know how to pronounce my name. So just before I go any further, I'm gonna let you guys know my name is Yaley. If you don't pronounce it correctly, I really don't care. People call me Yali, people call me JG, Jaja. It don't even matter anymore. <laughs> Today I created this look for you guys using the Lemonade Craze Palette from Maybelline. It's not yet dropped, that's what I I heard, yeah. But it is um, on Amazon, I believe, so I'll list that of course in the description box below. But all the other products that I'll be using today and that you'll be seeing, I got from Beautycon. And you know if you keep on watching I'll show you all the products that I got from Beautycon the ones that I purchased and the ones that I got for free and after that I'll be showing you how I got to this right here you know <laughs> so yeah just keep on watching guys all right so all the products that I got I put it all in this big Mac bag so I'm gonna just pull out everything um they're not in any order. And these are some of the bags that I got. I mean, bags are not really important. They kind of are, but this is from Sexy Hair. I got nothing from them because, I don't know. <laughs> I just got that bag because, you know, when it was over, when it was time to leave, everybody was just like, you know, giving out stuff. So yeah, this is um, a bag from Catrice. I actually pretty like this bag. My mom. When she saw it, she was like, wow, like, I like that bag. I'm like, really, a bag? Okay. Anyways, I'm going to just show you guys the bags first because I need to get that out of the way. This bag is from Peter Thomas Roth Clinical um, Skin Care. Yeah, you know the deal. So, of course, I got little perfume samples. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, this, pro this bag is from Winky Lux. And I got this lemonade pink lemonade lip plumper I really like this I purchased this I think it was 16 14 maybe 14 I'm not sure I don't remember but um I really love it I don't know why but it's just I, I have it on right now actually and it's such like a nice color it's it's not clear but it just has like a nice little pink lemonade color and it's just it's really beautiful and it has the lip plumping properties. I feel like those don't really work, but all they do is really sting your lips. Now, this, these are some samples that I got. Oh, this is actually, it was called, like, she called it a booster. She said that you wear this before you put on um, your skincare products. And what it does, it makes it work stronger, basically. Now, I got these face masks that I can't wait to try out. Oh my god, look at this one. This reminds me so much of Yorelis because it's a panda. I think it's a panda. It is a panda, but it looks kind of ugly. But yeah, it's a panda, and I, it reminds me of her because I saw her with um, an emoji mask the other day. And I was like, girl. But yeah, this is, um, you, it's like this, basically. And yeah, it's a panda, but it really looks like a raccoon. That's one, and then there's this one. I don't think it's like a peel off mask. No, it's definitely not. Oh, it is, it says peel and glow. I don't know, but that's this mask. And those two are from Soy. It's a tangerine luxe coconut and olive oil moisturizing mask. This is from Sani. It's a firm tone replenish. That's what it says, firm tone replenish. Here's what it looks like. It I don't really like tangerines or oranges, but you know, it's a mask. It's not like I'm eating it. <laughs> I even got some vitamins right here. These are actually really good. Like, I really recommend these. Like, this is, like, legit 
this is not sponsored I recommend these like crazy I tell people about this all the time these are the Vita Fusion gorgeous hair skin and nails from Urban Decay I got this quick fix hydro charge complexion prep priming spray right here it's like a miniature bottle and I also got the all-nighter basically like a swatch sample thing I'm from NYX I got this um strictly vinyl eyeliner and it's in the color alliance I believe yes it is um they also gave me this strictly vinyl lip gloss and this is in the color bombshell I also got the dual chrome highlight and what color is this lavender steel I got this born to glow um, highlighter in the color break the rhythm from absolute New York oh my god I really like this product it's um matchmaker lip jelly lipstick and it's like the winky lux lip lip thingy that has the flower inside like it's clear from Maybelline, I got the Lemon Craze palette, which is this really beautiful palette. This is the one that I use today. And I also got the Falsies Volume Express Mascara. From Anastasia Beverly Hills, I got this um, lip gloss in the color Fudge. I actually got two of these. And last but not least, I got these two um, MAC Dazzle Glass, you know, lip gloss. One of these I got for free and the other one I purchased and this is the one that I got for free is this pink one. It's pink. It just looks a little red. Let me swatch it. So that is what the free sample looks like. This is from MAC. Dazzle Glass. This is in the color Love Alert. Alright, so for starters, you already know the deal. I have my base already, which is my LA Girl Pro Conceal in the color yellow. And I, this all blended out. And now I'm just setting that with my airspun powder. So going in with this angled fluffy brush, I will be picking up Lemonade Craze, which is of course the beautiful yellow color from the palette. And I will be using this as my transition shade. But since these colors are not really that pigmented, I will be like first um, packing it on and then blending it out. Now I'm going to be taking my Anastasia brush, the one that comes in like inside the palettes, and I'm gonna use the fluffy side and I'll be picking up the color Ice Pop, which is this nice bright pink. It's really pretty. And I'm going to be putting that into my crease. I'm first going to pack it on and then I'm going to blend it out. So I will be taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills brush again, but like the smaller side. And I'm going to be picking up Old Fashioned, which is this dark color on the smaller side of the brush. And I'm going to focus this mostly on my outer corner and also blending it into my crease, but outer corner is like the most important part to me right now so I'm going to pack that on in the outer corner you know blend it and then drag it into my crease so that is it for those three colors and now I will be taking my LA girl pro conceal as always and I am going to be taking a flat brush with that to basically cut my crease you know the deal you know the deal dill pickles so this is good enough for the crease I'm only cutting it halfway and then I'm gonna take my finger and at the end I'm kind of going to blend it out so now to set um the concealer in place I'll be taking some air spun powder on the smaller side of my Anastasia Beverly Hills brush and basically patting it down because I don't want that to go anywhere and you know I have hooded eyes so the creases on my eyelids are crazy and I don't want it to go anywhere so I'm gonna do that I'll be taking Old Fashioned again from the Lemonade Craze palette and um I'm going I don't know why I just had to think about that but I'm gonna be taking that color and basically blending out the outer edges 
and deepening up the color as well so that's good enough and wetting my um this kind of flat brush or whatever wetting and I'm gonna be using that eyeliner brush I used in my last video which is crapped up and jacked up from Bobbi Brown this is the A62 eyeliner brush but I don't really use it for eyeliner I use it for something else clearly obviously and anyways I'm going to be taking that brush and dipping into citrus which is this beautiful color at the end I just love it that color right there and basically I'm going to place that all over my cut crease like that and at the end of this eye I did take a little bit of sugar coated which is this copper tone shimmer you can see and I'm just gonna be taking a little bit of that and basically putting it like at the end of that color because like I want to kind of blend into each other like that but I did go over again with a little bit more of citrus because I didn't like how it looked like I felt like it was they didn't really blend together so good the shimmers so I just put um, citrus over it again and it basically like deepened up the color citrus for me oh my god I hope I was recording because like my camera just shut off and it didn't make it didn't make a sound so I hope I was recording oh my god I'm gonna be taking my lash me up collection lashes yeah in the style oh Christine because these are nice and wispy and whatnot. So now I'm going to move on to my face and as well as my eyes. I will be using products that I got from Beautycon as well. And so to prime my face, I will be using this Hydra Charge Complexion Prep Priming Spray. Which it looks like this. This is from Urban Decay. Let me see what it says. I don't really see nothing like that. Anyways, I'm going to shake it up. And I'm going to use this to prime my face. Of course, it's just it's a primer. So, Alright, let me... There we go. It smells like sunscreen. <laughs> I will be doing my foundation now. I am going to do that one off camera. I'm gonna do my foundation, my concealer. What else? I'm gonna do everything off camera basically, and I'm gonna come back when it's when I'm doing my highlight. Yes, I'm gonna come back when I'm doing my highlight because I did get some highlighters and I wanted to show you guys like you know what that looks like. So I'll be back for that one. So for a highlight, I actually, you know, I received these two. These are like real quote unquote highlights. There's a Born to Glow by NYX and the Duo Chromatic Illuminating Powder from NYX as well. But I felt like none of these colors really will look good. Like I wanted like a true gold color. So I'm going to just use the eyeshadow palette that I got from Catrice. Yes, yes, yes. And I'm going to take the Sculpt color which is this one all the way up here. That one is like really gold, so I want to use that color. And I'm going to be using this brush that I got from my Ipsy bag. Uh, this is from Moda. Yeah. So I'm going to dip into that pretty gold color. You know, highlights to the gods. My cheekbones just to make it extra glowy. Like, are you guys seeing that right now? And like, you know, with a little bit of the excess, I'll be putting on my forehead and my chin to finish off the glow, you know, balance it out because bitches be looking crazy out here. So now my foundation lips are basically to the trash. Now, um, I don't really know what I want to use. I think I'm going to use my gloss. Definitely. But which one? That's the question. I don't know. <laughs> 
I'm going to be taking my lip plumper from Winky Lux in pink lemonade and I like this lip gloss so much like I'm this is really gonna be my favorite lip gloss for who knows how long now because it's such a pretty color like it's a light color and then it's a lip plumper like oh bit hold up backtrack so actually I'm using lemonade craze for my eyes and for my lips I'm using pink lemonade isn't that just such a wow that's just amazing that's just perfect so yeah I'm gonna go ham on this lip gloss and we are done with this look I hope you guys enjoyed this beautiful lemonade look I feel like this is great for the summer I really like the lemonade craze palette from Maybelline because of course I mean I created this look with it and you know this is a nice pretty bright um summery look but with that palette you can also do like a natural look like I'm gonna do one and I'm gonna show you guys because you can do a nice neutral look using that palette as well I hope you guys enjoy please make sure to like comment and subscribe to my channel you know I'm at 200 I cannot believe it I really can't anyways if you have any suggestions please make sure to leave it in the comments down below all my social medias will be listed in the description box I had to think about that one <laughs> and you know the products that I use of course it will always be down in the description box as well this um palette of course is still not out yet but I believe you can get it on Amazon but I'll I'll check for you guys and I'll just put it all in the description box below so yeah I hope you all have a nice day and I'll see you guys in the next one bye loves